what's going on welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be taking a look at not only the first of its kind on my channel but the first in my collection and that is the dreamville and croc collaboration now before we get into it please do me a favor drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel and do not forget to hit that notification bell so you get notified whenever i drop new videos and before we get into this, I want to thank everyone for the support on the last video I dropped, which was the Jordan 11 Low Cement Gray. I set a goal for this channel for 100 likes per video, and y'all just went all out. I got over 150 likes on that video, so thank you. It really did help you know, a lot of new subscribers to the channel whenever y'all like the video. It gets it out to a lot of other people, man. I really do appreciate it. Like The support on that video was crazy, so keeping that momentum going forward let's see if we can get this video to 100 likes as well so do me a favor go ahead drop a like right now now let's get right into it shall we so i'm excited to bring this to the channel y'all it's something different um when i saw you know if you don't know dreamville was actually going on in um you know last weekend it's uh, j cole's music festival that he puts on in raleigh north carolina and um, it was actually, you know, I watched it on Amazon Prime. I didn't actually go to this, but I did go to the first one in 2019, which is where I got this shirt from. Um, and when I saw that they, all the merch and everything they had, I bought like a hoodie or whatever. Then I saw they had some Crocs. And I was like, you know what? Never had a pair of Crocs, but I've always heard good things about the comfort. And they weren't lying. They are really comfy. We're going to talk about that too. So as you can see here, they come in this box. And, well, not box. I'm so used to viewing shoes. They come in this bag. And it's got Dreamville branding right here, Crocs. And then you also have some Dream text right across the front there, uh, which is cool. I don't know if all Crocs come in this bag or whatnot. Maybe some, maybe not. But let's go ahead and get them out, okay? I'm sure y'all know who J. Cole is, but if y'all don't know, he's a rapper from Fayetteville, North Carolina, and Dreamville is his, like, record label slash group, you know. And now the festival that they have in Raleigh, North Carolina, which is a lot of fun. If you have an opportunity to go, I highly suggest it. So we'll go ahead and get this uh, bag out of the way, and let's take a look at the Crocs, y'all. So here they are, the Dreamville Crocs, y'all. Drop your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think. Um, I think these are super clean, man. Like, I have to... You know, I never understood the hype behind Crocs, but when I saw these, me being a J. Cole fan, I was like, let me just try them out, right? And they come with all these, I think they're called gibbets or something like that. Um, but look at, on the left shoe, they're pretty much the same Croc. So the color on these, they look like, let me see here, insert, they look black here, but in certain lighting, they look brown. So right now they look like they are, they're black. So I mean like black and like kind of a beige, just cream looking color. And you've got all these different charms or gibbets on the left shoe. Um, wait, let's start with the, uh, yeah, this is the left shoe. So on the left shoe, it spells out, you know, well, we're gonna start with this one actually, because on the right shoe, you have the word dream. So if you read it out, it says D-R-E on the right shoe and then A-M dream. So you got dream spelled out there and you have several other charms or gibbets on the actual shoe. And the letters at least had this kind of like terry cloth or like a letterman jacket type uh, feel to it so you have the dre there you've also got a charm for new york right here and you've got a chicago one right here on the side as well as you got you gotta have north carolina you got that right there on the toe of it all right so pretty nice and then you've got this like strap here you know if you want to put it i think sport mode is what people call it um but you got the strap back here and on the side there you do see on the uh i guess lateral side of the shoe let's start there you have the dreamville logo the d there okay all right and speaking of lateral side we'll just go around just like we do with any other shoe um you've got these like you know it mentions the black upper you got these kind of little you know dents or like dots over all around the shoe here and of course you've got the little croc you know holes in it like you do with any other shoe and on the medial side there another look at it all right and on the back of the heel you do have the crocs text right there okay 
And on the inside, you have all these like little divots or like things on the bottom of the foot. And I thought this would, you know, be a little uncomfortable, but it's actually not. It actually feels pretty good on my foot at least. And here's a look at the outsole. Um, I don't see anything Dreamville related on the outsole. So you just got your standard outsole there. Okay. And that was the left shoe. Let's take a quick look at the right. Okay. So on the right one, you have, you know, AM, so the end of the word dream there. All right. You got Atlanta up here, a little flag there. You've got, what is that, Los Angeles down here. Sorry, right over here. And you have this one here, which is uh, Washington, D.C. right there. All right. And also, you can see the Dreamville one up here, the yellow. I really like that Dreamville charm right there, so. Pretty nice. I'm excited to have these, man. Like, like I said, it's the first Croc in my collection, the first on this channel. If you're a fan of Crocs, let me know. Like, how do y'all feel about it? Is there a particular Croc model that I need to try? Or, you know, is there like a, let me see how these actually work. Just let me know how you feel about them, man, because I'm actually really liking these. Y'all might see me with Crocs on now. I never thought I would buy a pair, but hey, here I am. Uh, but yeah, just one more quick look actually at both of them again. So y'all can get a look at both of the actual Crocs, man. I really like these gibbets or charms on them. Really, really nice, man. Okay, now let's go ahead. Oh, one quick thing. Before we get into sizing and all that stuff there, these um, actually, you could get them from uh, Crocs website, of course, but I looked last night and they're actually already sold out. So um, they have another pair. There's actually, um, these are the clog model of Croc, which is probably what, whenever I hear Crocs, this is the model that I think about. But they also have um, a kind of slide model. So they did make the Dreamville collab in the slide model and they are also on uh, Amazon. So I got these from Amazon um, and they do have those slides up there. And I like these so much that I might go back and get the slides, man. I really might go back and get them because these retailed for US retail price of $69.99 and the slides retail for a retail price of $39.99. So I might go back and get those just to kind of have them in the collection because it is a special Dreamville edition. Like I said, I'm a J. Cole fan, so might as well grab them. All right, now we've talked about the Croc. We've went over all that stuff. I've showed y'all the different charms on them and whatnot. Another look at, I just really like the charms on these, man, or the gibbets. I just really like these, man. Like these are actually pretty cool. Now let's go ahead and talk about the usual, the sizing. Now, I am a size, well, pretty much a true size nine. And um, I got these in a size nine. My foot measures at around an eight and a half, but I don't buy eight and a halves. And these don't come in half sizes. That's one thing to point out. So I usually buy everything in a size nine or nine and a half. Technically a nine is my true size. And that's what I got these in. And they fit perfect. Now, I wore these once with thick socks. Well, I tried them on with thick socks. And it was more like an exact, not an exact fit. I had maybe a little bit of room back here, but it was because the sock was so thick. But even with thick socks on, I had no issues right here. Like this is a pretty wide clog. And I don't know if they all, pretty much probably all are this way, but I have a slightly wide foot and I had no issues at all with this on my foot. They felt great. And as soon as I put them on, I could not help but compare it to another very popular slide model and you had to guess it the adidas yeezy slide and when i put these on immediately i was like these are more comfortable than the Yeezy slides honestly now i know they are more comfortable than the og models that had like the very like kind of more um, solid foam the later models they went to like a more softer foam and those are cool too but when i put this on my foot there was no issues with getting my foot in here at all the footbed of the shoe is super soft. And I was just like, wow, these are really comfortable. And I do actually like them. So, um, but again, go true to size with these. You should have no problem at all with or without socks, at least on my feet. Um, so that's that. And do I think it's a must pick up for these y'all? I'm gonna say probably for most people, no. Um, but like I said, I've never owned a pair of Crocs and I actually really like these, man. And being a J. Cole fan and everything, that's what really made me buy these shoes. I was like, let me just go ahead and try them out, you know? And I'm glad I did, because now I think I'm a Croc fan. I was looking on the website last night at all the different charms. They had some Mario charms, like might have to get that. If I see like any video game related stuff, I might go ahead and pick those charms up. So I can see the appeal 
of Crocs when it comes to the different charms or gibbets you can buy and kind of customize it. So that's kind of cool. Um, but yeah, man, overall, I'm happy with it, man. If you are a J. Cole, a Dreamville fan, man, like go ahead, comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Now, like I said, I'm probably going to go back and get those slides that are on Amazon as well. I just wanted to share this with you all because, you know, I just got them in and I just really, really like them and they are super comfortable, y'all. Why didn't y'all tell me the Crocs were so comfortable? Why? Y'all should have told me about this, man. Like, we talk about comfort of these shoes all the time, man. Like, the Croc never came up. So don't be surprised if you see more Croc reviews on this channel, okay? I'm going to tell y'all right now. I'm all for comfort. And when I put these things on, they were right. They they are pretty nice. I can't, I can't lie. These are pretty good. I don't really wear my Yeezy slides at all, so... But it being a foam, you know, shoe, the Croc, and I had, I couldn't help but compare the two. And from first putting my foot in, I, like I haven't worn these yet, as you can see, but just sliding my foot in, I was like, the Crocs might be, might take the W in the uh, comfort department. But that's just me. Again, y'all, I thank all, thank every one of you for the support in the channel, man. Like I said, that last video was really, really it was it was a pretty successful video. I do appreciate it. Again, drop a like on the video because we're trying to get every video to 100 likes so I can bring y'all more content. Thank you for watching. I appreciate all the support and I will see you guys in the next video.